Hi everyone, it's me Liam, and a lot of times I get questions about the marathon, and I thought I would create this quick video to answer them. So I get asked about when the marathon is, what the marathon is, and a lot of other questions. So I've compiled this Q&A, and I hope it helps you, and maybe it will solve some of the confusion. So the first question that I always get is, what is the marathon? And the marathon is a way for me to recoup costs over the past year. It helps, uh, helps me pay the bills and definitely helps me upgrade equipment. Obviously, as you know, uh, games cost money, consoles cost money. And so doing these uh, streams can cost money. And so it helps recoup those costs. It also is a great way for me to entertain you guys and for us to kind of have fun. It's a couple days of gaming and kind of a big party and, you know, people hang out and we have a good time. When does the marathon start? So the marathon starts November 19th, which is either today or tomorrow, depending on where you are and when you're watching this video. It will start at 10 a.m. U.S. time Eastern, so U.S. Eastern time, 9 a.m. U.S. Central time, 7 a.m. Pacific time, so all you folks on the West Coast in the United States, $1,500 UTC, and Sunday morning at 1 a.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time. Obviously, this is not an exhaustive list of time zones, but hopefully these time zones will give you an idea about when the marathon is going to start in your time. Another question that I get is how long will the marathon last? So the marathon is supposed to start at 12 hours, but realistically, I would like to go all weekend. There will be a few breaks so that I can stretch and get up, get food and possibly take a nap if we go into Sunday. Uh, also, there will be breaks so that I can break the archives down into pieces. YouTube will not archive anything over 12 hours. So I want to make sure that we don't miss any of the uh, marathon. Everyone can watch it later in case they miss it. How can I catch the marathon? Uh, this is something I asked a lot. I mean, if you're watching this video, well, you're already on the right channel. Uh, if you don't, care for YouTube that much, there is an audio stream. I always do ask that people use the video stream as that is what helps monetize the channel. And that is something that is very helpful for me and, you know, to keep the channel going. Uh, there will also be a Quentin C's Playroom free table open. So if you'd like to chat with other viewers and have a social experience, that is another thing you can do. I will not be actively checking the table, but you are always welcome to use it and talk with fellow viewers. Uh, let's talk about the giveaway for a quick second. Can I enter the giveaway more than once? And the answer is no. So for those that know uh, how the giveaway works in past years, I will give you a secret word. Every couple hours, the word changes. And this is so that people will actually tune in and check out the stream. Uh, it's no fun if... You just give people a form to fill out and they don't come hang out and get the secret word. So that's my way to make sure that people come and hang out. Um, you can only enter once, but you can choose two prizes or you can choose the same prize twice. So if you really have your heart set on the swamp prize pack, you can choose it twice and double your chances to win. Um, do I have to stick around the whole time to win? And the answer is no, you don't have to be present for the prize draw. You will get emailed if you win. And, um, there will be a posting that will list all the winners just in case maybe your email doesn't work or there was a problem. So there will be a list. So you can check that for sure and find out if you won. Uh, do I have to donate to enter the giveaway? No. In fact, donations are completely optional and we'll talk about those in a second, but it is free for anyone to enter to win. That's what it's here for. It's just a nice extra bonus. Obviously I've got some really awesome sponsors that have sponsored over $300 worth of prizes. And I appreciate that immensely. Uh, how do donations work? So there's a few uh, answers to this. Uh, the first one is that you donate using either you, uh, PayPal or YouTube's Super Chat feature. I would prefer, if you can, to please use the 
Streamlabs donation link, which you will find in the description of the marathon and also on the marathon page. Um, the reason is, is that YouTube will take money out of super chats. I believe it's 30%. So let's just say that somebody donates a hundred dollars, 30 of those dollars are going back into YouTube's pocket. And, um, so if you're trying to donate to help me out, I don't see 30% of anything that you donate with super chat. I know it's easier. Uh, I know it's kind of quicker, but, um, I just want to be honest about that and let you guys know how that works. But, uh, ultimately whatever you use, I appreciate. And, uh, if you super chat, I do not count or I won't, I won't count it against you. So let's say you donate $10. Uh, I will count the $10. I don't count $7. We're not petty like that. We'll count the full amounts. Um, but I'm just letting you know that YouTube will take its share off the top. PayPal also takes a little bit off the top, but is more reasonable in how it does things. So that's acceptable, you know, and it's like maybe 30 cents to a dollar, which is way better than $10, obviously. Uh, for more information on the marathon, you can visit lirvin.me slash marathon. That link is also in this video. And I do hope that this video helps you. Um, I did have a couple questions. People are, were asking about the wheel and the marathon page explains the wheel pretty well. But in short, the wheel of pain is something that we spin every time that we reach $50 in donations. So 50, 100, 150, 200, so on and so forth. Um, on the wheel, there are different things that can happen. I can have to eat a spicy jelly bean. I can have to eat one of the bean boozled beans. Think Harry Potter, every flavored beans. I may have to drink a gross soda. Soda flavors include peanut butter, bacon, uh, ranch dressing, buffalo wing, grass, dirt, pumpkin pie, and sweet corn. Those are our sodas. Uh, mustard soda may show up. Uh, during the marathon, if uh, the post office uh, agrees with me. So that will be another thing on the wheel. Also, there are clothespins on my ears and face. There is uh, things that might be uh, nice for me to do, like stretching and have a delicious haichu. But uh, by and large, there are just a lot of different things that I can have to do. Oh, and I can't forget that there is also the three strikes on the wheel. If we get three strikes, I have to play an hour of a game and that game is blind quest. And if you know me and know the channel, you know that I do not like blind quest. So I will have to play an uninterrupted hour of blind quest. I can't stop. It doesn't matter how angry I'm getting. I have to stick with it. Um, there are also ways to get free spins. So one thing you guys can do is every marathon video for this year, give it a like. So while you're watching, click that thumbs up link. A hundred likes on any particular part is a free spin. So if part one, part two, part three, get a hundred likes, that's three spins. If we get a hundred viewers concurrently on YouTube, um, that will also be a free spin. And, um, we will kind of see how that goes, but I want to give you guys chances for some free spins. And those are all things that you can do without donating, clicking a like button, getting your friends to tune in, um, making sure that you're hanging out and watching. So those are all things that you can do. And, um, we have one other thing. So if we reach $2,000, which is a lofty goal, but if we can reach it, there's a problem with these sodas, which is they are not resealable. Once I open a soda, I have to drink it. I don't have a choice. I have to drink it, but I don't want to drink an entire bottle of soda. So the leftover soda from the bottle that gets opened goes into the thermos of doom. Now, keep in mind, I just listed off all the names of the sodas. They don't sound very good. Think about how disgusting they would be together. If we reach $2,000, I will start taking drinks out of the thermos of doom, which can possibly contain all eight sodas. So there's something to look forward to unless you're me. So that right there is a list of questions that I get for these marathons. I apologize if this video is a little long and verbose, but I hope that it answers some questions. I will definitely refer back to it during the marathon and, um, you know, 
I will probably say all this stuff again during the marathon, but I want this to be a guide to the marathon so that you know what's going on. I've got it all down here and I cannot wait for this thing to kick off. Remember, it is October or November 19th. Not that'd be bad. It'd be a month ago. It is November 19th, pretty much, you know, 14 hours from when I'm recording this video. So I hope this helps you. I hope it has given you some info that you can use. And remember, the important thing is you can only enter the contest once, even if the word of the, you know, the secret word changes more than one entry disqualifies you. So please don't do it. Um, be fair, you know, play nice and let's have a fun marathon. We're going to give away a ton of great prizes. We're going to have a lot of fun, play some games, and I will see you all very soon. As always, thanks for watching and or listening.